right, let's do this. The Mega King going one on one with Judas. Yeah, Omega King using that size and strength advantage over Judas. Got him right in that top rope. Oh, hung up in that rope. Omega King in incredible shape. Doing a lot of that DDP yoga. Omega yes, King. he does. He does, yeah. So do I. Do I don't do as much as the Mega King does. I'm not I'm not able to do that, <laughs> but uh, I am in fact the one who recommended DDP yoga to the Mega King. Well, that's a great recommendation there. Standing side headlock here by the former EWF world champion. I've got some tips from the man himself. DDP? Yes, I have. A couple years back, met DDP at Cauliflower Island. I am aware of that. I'll let everybody else know that too. Yes. Yes. Side headlock. Here about the Mega King. Both men now working their way back up to the feet here. Jude Diz and the Mega King. Got the original Mr. Wonderful Rock Riddle on the outside with Gold Digger. Oh, oh one foot drop kick. And, and it was enough to take the Mega King out. And that Mega King on the outside. Gold Digger and Rock Riddle checking on the Mega King. Hey, at least she's honest. Yeah. Can't fault her for that. What do you think she's drinking tonight out there? She got her, uh, her goblet out there. I don't know. Maybe, maybe drinking some of that Kool-Aid. Well, we know you've drank plenty of Kool-Aid in your time. Extra sugar. Mega King on his way back into the ring now. What kind of material do you think that jacket of Rock Riddle's made out of? Well, whatever it's made out of, you can bet it's expensive, Wade. Oh, definitely out of my pay grade. Look at you, Diz. Oh, hitting the Mega King. And again with the shoulder block. Mega King staggering. Jude Diz putting his whole body into it. Mega King wrapped up in the ropes. Jude Diz now. Irish whipping is reversed now. Into the ropes. Sunset flip. Got him on up. King rolled over. Wow, the agility of the Mega King. Over the King. figure four. Oh, and the Mega King. To the outside again. Mega King could thank that DDP Yoga for that agility earlier. But you did went for that sunset flip. Mega King was able to roll all the way out of it. Yeah, there's no part in DDP Yoga where you where it instructs you how to how to land when you get thrown out of the ring. All right? I wasn't suggesting that. I was saying it has increased the Mega King's agility. Especially for a man his size. One of the biggest men to ever compete in the EWF, the Mega King. Judas now off oh. the with the elbow. Goes for the cover here, too, with three. No, 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 no three there, Wade. Yeah, that, was, that was two. Take a lot more than that. Top wrist like a fly by Judas now on the Mega King. Mega King with that right Say hand. that a little slower, Wade. Say what? His name? Jude Diz. Okay, all right. Irish whip, it is reversed. Mega King into the ropes. Ducks the clothes on Mega King. Mega King. Oh. Right. He hit him in the hand, so he blocked it. Tried to block it. No, he did block it. He kicked his hands. See him shaking his hands? Yeah, I did see that. If he hadn't, didn't block it, Wade, he'd be unconscious. This match would be over. Now Mega King smartly but now he's working on the arm. Got that left arm wrapped around that. He damaged his hands when he hit that Mega Kick. Now being the experienced veteran, the former World Heavyweight Champion the Mega King is, he's going to go to work. Well, Jude Diz does a little bit of fight left in the air with the right hand. Oh, what a jawbreaker there by the Mega King. Quickly trying to go. Well, I thought he was going to go for a cover. Turned Judas over onto his stomach. Drove that knee right into Judas. 
Oh, man. Megan King got the, the arm of Drew Diz wrapped around that middle rope, threw his body through the ropes, making his own body, and whiplashed that arm. Vega King now with Drew Diz in the corner. Pretty to top wrist. Oh. Going up to that arm and that wrist again. Oh, wow, chopped by the Mega King. Mega King with that club to the back of Judez. Oh, we've seen this here. Oh, by the Mega King. Mega, oh, what an arrogant cover by the Mega King. Only gets a two count. No, it could have been three, but the ref was out of position. Oh, you blame it on the ref? Yes. Should have hooked the leg. Judas thrown to the outside. The referee had Turn around, ref. Rock Riddle. Oh, come on. Rock Riddle with that club to the back. Turn around, ref. Oh, now fire. Oh, come on. That Jezebel. How do you know she's a Jezebel? Oh, come on. You know, you're just calling women names, Wade. You sound like a frustrated she threw, man. She threw her champagne or whatever the heck that drink was right in the face of Judas. That's despicable. She ain't got no business being out there. Judas down with the main key. Oh, what a back body drop. Judas now hooks the leg, goes to the cover, and gets a two count. Wow. Judas, oh wait a minute, Mega King trips up Judas. Going for a figure four. Mega King's got it locked in. Wait, oh wait a minute now, Mega King now has turned it into an STF. Yeah. yeah, we've seen him do that before. Where well, he hooks him into a figure four, but then he turns him over. So he's got him really wrapped up into that STF. And the positioning, near perfect in the center of the ring there. Referee Mickey Marino asking to Diz if he's going to tap or not. Well, he's able to get to that bottom rope. I think not. I think I don't think he passed. Oh, he got to the bottom rope. Yeah, I did. Hard to see from a vantage point here. The depth perception not really on key tonight. You want me to call the ambulance, Wade, or you just want to call the match, all right? I'm trying to call the match. Mega bomb coming up here. Oh, no, he got out of it. Judas is on the ropes. Again with that one-foot drop kick. And the Mega King. You know, he keeps using that one foot. I want the ref to check that boot. Because he keeps using just that one foot. I want to know what's in that boot. Yeah, his foot. Yeah. Irish bit bits reversed. Why isn't he using both feet? Going for the crucifix. Maybe not his style. She did all the way out. Turned it into a sunset here. Whoa. Only two count. Small package roll up here by Judas. Only gets a two. Now Judas. La Magistral. Yeah, going for it here again. Another cover on Two count. What a chop there by the Mega King. Spinning top wrist lock. Modified version of a snapmare. And now. Oh, he got out of it. Oh! Mega King. Oh! Mega King could be unconscious after that. Yeah, especially with what I'd like to know what's in that one boot. She does now go to the outside. Gonna climb the top. Judas now perched up on that top turnbuckle. Mega King's back up. Again with the one boot. I saw both this time. That missile drop kick off the... Look at Rock Riddle on the apron. And Gold Digger's on the other side. And Gold Digger on the other side now as well. Oh, you know what that is? That's kryptonite right there. Kryptonite. You know what I'm getting at, Wade. Hey, wait a minute now. Judas, watch out. Oh. Mega kick. He super kicked him in the back. Goes with the cover, and that's it. Mega King. <laughs> he super kicked him in the back of the head, Wade. 
And you know why? Why? Because his back was to him. Oh, That's yeah, why. Of course. Yeah. When you got Rock Riddle and Gold Digger distracting Jude Diz and the referee. Well, and your name is that stupid, Wade. Why not? I know. I'll ask, I'll ask the Mega King afterwards, why'd you super kick him in the back? And he'll say the same thing that I just said to you. His back was to me. 